Lactation is a positive feedback loop which occurs in the body. During pregnancy, high progesterone and estrogen levels prepare the breasts for milk production. The suckling of the nipple by the child produces milk. The greater the suckling of the nipple, the greater the production of the milk. During lactation, the mechanical stimulation of the nipple by a suckling child sends impulses to the hypothalamus which in turn sends impulses to the anterior pituitary. The anterior pituitary releases oxytocin. The oxytocin stimulates the effectors, which are the cells surrounding the milk producing glands of the breast. The effector cells contract and the milk is released from the nipple. The milk production then increases the original stimulus. This increases the response of oxytocin, which will further stimulate the effectors. This will result in a positive feedback loop. A negative feedback loop is created as the person touches the thorn. First, sensory fibers in the skin detect the painful stimulus and send this information to nerve cells in the spinal cord. The sensory fibers enter the spinal cord and synapse upon the interneurons in the spinal cord. And these interneurons synapse to the motor neurons which control the skeletal muscle. The flexor muscles in the front of the arm are directed to contract while the extensor muscles relax.